I'm back. <laughs> to watch me a step around, do not. This is what I made uh, the archaeology thing. Under there's the archaeology that I found the other day. But unless you've watched the video, you wouldn't have a clue what I'm talking about. So, so there we are. There we are. Now it doesn't look like it's doing a lot, but there is plenty of heat coming off of it. And in all honesty, you don't want any more than that. We should just come bugger it up. So, in a jiffy, we will be putting the wood chips on. Until that time, what we're going to do, we're going to slather some olive oil on it. There we are. Slap it up with olive oil like a Roman legion there. And it will scrape his skin until it is clean. But lucky, you know, if you don't know your history, don't know about it. No, seriously, that's what they used to do. Yeah, it's like, uh, I think they got it from the Greeks. The Greeks used to do that a lot, is um, slab themselves in olive oil and then get someone to... Uh, Give the skin a good scrape, usually after like having a hot bath and then a cold bath. Open the pores up. Maybe you remember Rimmer from Red Dwarf Pint <laughs> slapped <it> up <laughs> in olive oil before he was prepared for his um, being offered as a meal. <laughs> oh boy. All right, let's have we go. We're not too far away now. Yes, yeah, it's just going a nice white colour and there's still plenty of heat coming off of it. So that's a good thing. Now then, where's my rag on? Here it is. Get the rag on there. We'll take away a little bit of that moisture. Now that is, that is plenty to get us going. So I'm just going to put you down a minute so I'll find somewhere where you won't do the usual and go falling over. There you are. In case you're wondering where you are, you're in the shed in the back garden. That's why it's all got a bit dark and gloomy. Right, so these wood chips, they're nicely sodden through. So hopefully... The idea is that they'll burn through nice and slowly. We'll stick the chicken on there. We'll leave it for half an hour. There you are. We'll leave it for half an hour. And uh, have another look at it. And hopefully it will be cooking very slowly indeed. And the chicken will come out nice and tender. Oh, chicken. Put the plate down. Oh, I can really smell the wood chip. Now remember with chicken you can get nasty food poisoning so whatever utensils you use when it's raw is make sure you give them a clean. So 
This is just a normal barbecue which can be turned into a smoker. We shut in, he says famous last words, shut in that vent. And we're opening that vent. So we're hopefully the air will go in there and swirl around inside here and make its way out. See, it's all coming out around here, look. And that is where the chicken is. Don't know why it keeps doing that, I'm sorry. So there we are. Now we're going to leave it for half an hour. And what I'll do is rather than just driving up the wall with a load of nonsense, I'll get back towards the end of the cooking so hopefully you can see the outcome. Bye, bye.